What's up everybody? My name is Danny. This is SpendLessStore.com YouTube channel, Spend Less Tools. In today's video, we are going to go over this Ryobi 8-inch uh, pole saw. Model number on this guy is P2501. Again, it's P2501. Um, this guy comes with a sheath cover or a blade cover, so you can kind of put it over the blade when you're not using it and that will just kind of slide over the blade like so. This is gonna keep the blade from nicking either seats or anything else when it's not in use and it kind of makes it a little safer and then that'll come off to use it. You can, so it comes with three sections. You can actually use it with only two sections and it's gonna be a lot easier to handle depending on whether or not you need the extra length or not. So. Another thing, when you're lining these up, you'll see a little uh, bolt here and a bolt here. There's also one on the opposite side. So you can line those bolts up, and if they don't take like that, you know you spin it 180 degrees and it's gonna drop right in. And then you can thread this, and it's gonna pull that tight. And then from there, we'll drop our battery in the bottom. And it does have a safety that you need to pull out of your way here for your thumb. And then when you pull the trigger, you're going to get the thing spinning and you're going to be able to cut with it. And I'm going to go ahead and demo and show you. You can insert the that middle piece as well and show you how that'll work and look. Um, so basically, it's going to work the same instead of putting that one on here. And you're going to want to make sure that, so you see this sleeve comes up, that this sleeve also is facing up. So that way you have one going up from each one. Again, you're going to line those same bolts up that I just mentioned earlier. And if they don't take like this, you know to flip it around and it will. And then again, we're going to thread it, tighten that down, pull those fittings together nice and tight. And then we're going to go ahead and do the same with this. On the second one, it's a little easier because you have the angle of the head and the handle that you can look at to make sure that you're lined up as well the correct way. And again, this is going to give you a little bit more reach. So if you got a higher branch, you can get to it. Um, but again, it's gonna make it a little bit harder to handle. But that is the Ryobi eight uh, inch pole saw for 18, uh, 18 volt. They do make this for a 40 volt battery as well. And I believe it's a 10 inch, um, 10 inch rather than an eight for the blade on that one. And uh, that's that, guys. Thanks so much for watching. If anybody does have any ideas for future videos, please don't hesitate to let us know. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe. We're giving away this entire DeWalt drill kit at the end of March here. Um, and we're not that huge, so it gives you a pretty good chance to win. If anybody needs anything else, let us know. Otherwise, we will see you in our next video. Thanks so much, guys. Have a great one.